Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. Customer states, vibration and driveline. The shop wasn't informed on how this happened, however, they think this Jeep was left in four-wheel drive while being flat towed. And this vehicle drove to the shop with this really worn out wheel bearing. The technician said the CV axle boot was on fire when the customer arrived to the shop. Oh, that's just a little loose. Customer states when he closed the sliding door, it sounds like a cow. <laughs> customer states driver's front seat will not move forward. This vehicle came in as a check engine light is on. The code was P0326 in regards to the knock sensor. The technician found that somebody had just replaced the knock sensor and installed it on the intake manifold instead of the engine. The customer approved the repairs to have it properly installed. You can see where they took the original knock sensor and just left it hanging there. Customer states they have a power steering leak. This customer's vehicle is equipped with electric steering and was actually leaking coolant from the water pump. The technician mentioned that the customer kept adding power steering fluid to the coolant reservoir, and the low coolant light was also on, which the customer did not say anything about. <laughs> I just love it. It's different. The customer of this vehicle has owned it for 3,000 miles and it already needs a new clutch. The technician said a month after this one was installed, the customer needed another clutch installed. He also mentioned that the customer decided to trade it in afterwards for a vehicle with an automatic transmission. Customer came in for service unrelated to this, actually for body damage, but um, I don't think that will work. This technician was doing a pre-delivery inspection on this brand new SUV and noticed an issue with the paint. And this customer came in as they can hear a noise when accelerating. The customer just installed a new exhaust that rubs against the CV axle when the engine is under load. And this customer came in for an alignment after he said his friend installed new ball joints and other front end parts. Customer states they replaced the rear wiper blade several times and the wiper still does not wipe the window 100%. This technician noticed this when his vehicle came in for an oil change, and the customer said he apparently changed his engine oil 5,000 miles ago. I hope you enjoyed this video and please consider leaving a like or subscribing if you haven't already. Thanks for watching.